Hello and welcome back to my vlog. Today I am vlogging outside and I think that maybe that'll be more interesting to look at, hopefully. I don't know. Anyway, today I am vlogging about things that I like. And I decided to vlog about this because, you know, I noticed that there are a couple of people watching this vlog and I was thinking that they might not like to know a little bit more about me and then, you know, kind of give a guide for some things that I might talk about in future vlogs. So as you can see though, I got my glasses fixed, so it's nice. And I hope it's not too noisy because there's the river right here as well as the road behind me. But hopefully that will not be a problem for this vlog. Um, I've come to an interesting place that I have not really walked around in before. So hopefully I'll have a good time looking around as well. So things I like, um, figure skating. I am crazy about figure skating. Um, I have been since I was in elementary school and um, look at this. I think that it is an awesome sport. So um, in elementary school, it was the 1998 Nagano Olympics. And this is aging me a little bit if you care to calculate that. <laughs> um, anyway, uh, I was obsessed with Michelle Kwan. I'm sure everyone's going to be talking about how I was walking around talking to a camera next week. Um, and I still think that she is one of the most talented and graceful figure skaters of all time. Um, so there is that. Let's switch hands, shall we? Sorry. Um, nowadays, I like um, Asada Mao and I like Takahashi Daisuke as far as men's skating goes. And I think Japanese skating has really come a long way in the last couple of years. And I am a big fan of Daisuke. Um, I kind of wish you, the US would, you know, get themselves back into the sport because it's, it's been a long time now since there's been anybody I thought was really exceptional. Although recently I um, have see, noticed this guy, Max Aaron, and um, you know, he's not got too much going on for him in the way of artistry yet, but I think that he will in the future. I don't really see the point of Patrick Chang. Sorry if anyone's a fan of him. Um, I just, his technical elements are good enough, but I just don't see the point of him. He's not, he doesn't, his skating doesn't move me in any way. So, that's a problem. Other things I like, um, I like superhero movies. Um, I like everything from more campy things like the old Batman movies to the really dark like the new Batman movies. <laughs> and uh, my favorite is probably the Iron Man movies just because I like them because they're funny um, in addition to you know being epic and action-packed and I think that they're really good. Um, I like Sensu which are folding fans, um, Japanese folding fans, you've seen them, they're the little paper fans, and uh, I got started collecting them because I received some from my dad's mom, and uh, oh look at this, isn't this nice? It'd be pretty in the spring. Sorry about that, my camera got full and I went and deleted all of the videos on the camera, so hopefully that should be enough to make space. Someone I know over there. Um, where was I? Since oh uh, yeah, I got started from my gr from my grandma. So um, 
my dad and his parents lived in Japan for a little while actually when he was growing up in uh, Kyushu. And so I received a bunch of them from her and I'm not like a super big collector, I don't buy them everywhere I go, but I do like them a lot and I um, really enjoy receiving a new one. I've got two um, pretty expensive ones here and um, they are very special and I like them a lot. Other than fans, I like Hello Kitty. Um, they have these regional limited Hello Kitties pretty much everywhere you go in Japan and they're really nice. So um, I collect them. Oh, that's the afternoon siren. Um, I collect them uh, wherever I go in Japan. Um, they're really cute. They have like the different regional specialties. They have, you know, famous places on them and I like them a lot. Also because a lot of my kids seem to think that Katie sounds like Kitty, and so the joke for a long time was, uh, hello Katie. <laughs> I like video games. Uh, I'm not as big into it as I used to be in college, but um, I do still like them. Uh, I am a PlayStation girl. I have a PlayStation 3. Um, and I like Final Fantasy. I like Uncharted, I like Assassin's Creed, those are just name a few. Um, I don't really like online gaming. Um, I have a lot of friends who do, but I don't know, I don't really see the point. Um, so what else do I like? I like Futurama. Uh, it's one of you know those adult cartoons, it's probably the only one I still watch pretty seriously. And I just, I don't know, I like it because it's a lot smarter humor than most of the things that I'm used to watching, so, um, I really enjoy that. And, um, I'm gonna brand myself maybe as a nerd here, but I do like anime. Um, I got into it in junior high school when it was really big in America. Um, and like Dragon Ball and Gundam and all that stuff were on TV and I really liked it um, and you know I was in like the anime club in high school I don't watch as much anymore but I'm always on the lookout for recommendations so if you know anything good um, some of my favorites are probably Kenshin, Gundam, um, Code Geass, and Ronin Warriors uh, and my all-time favorite is Sailor Moon. Yes, I know, but I love it. And um, this summer, anyway, there's going to be a new Sailor Moon series. Um, I think it's going to be targeted for a little older audience, for like original fans of the series, so you should definitely check it out. Um, and last but not least, I like music. I was in chorus in high school, I like all kinds of music. But for the purposes of this video, I'm going to talk about um, Japanese music. I like J-pop a lot. Um, and of course, you know, I like a lot of different artists. Uh, female singers, it's Kotakumi or Namie. Um, Namie Muro. I don't really like a lot of female singers in Japan just because of like the way that they're taught to sing. It's just really nasal and high-pitched. Um, but I like like AAA. When I was in high school, my J-pop true love was TM Revolution, and I still really like him. His voice is really amazing. Um, but now I'm kind of Johnny's girl, um, and I am not ashamed. So um, I like a lot of the Johnny's groups. I like Snap, V6, Tokyo, Kinky Kids. Uh, news, Cat-Tune, Kanjani particularly, um, ABCZ, and um, but my very favorites are Taki and Spasa, and they are some of the less popular ones, but I also think that they are some of the more worthwhile. They're both really, really talented, and I am just crazy about them. What can I say? Um, so... Yeah, um, you'll probably get to see me go to a Johnny's concert with my friend Jessica in the future here and see what that's like, which is
kind of a process, you know, they don't make it easy for you to go. But um, probably really near future, because I'm going this week to um, ABCZ's concert in Hiroshima with her. So I'll probably film that. And I've got a couple of other ideas. But I think that that is it for today. Um, those are the things I like. Anyone who's watching, you want to tell me about like what you like, uh, or maybe you know comment on the video and the things I talked about. And I don't know if there's anything you'd like to see me film because I'm really trying to get a routine going here. So, um, well, we're about back at my car. So I had a nice little walk through that park and we talked about my favorite things. So see you guys again sometime soon. Peace.